Bulls are getting slaughtered day after day after day. And if you focus on one thing, on this one thing, it literally makes it super clear. What's going on, guys? It's Ricky. I hope that you learned something new. I'll keep today's video super short and sweet. And if you do, please make sure that you drop a thumbs up and subscribe. I'm not here to trigger anyone. If you get offended, it's probably because you're losing money and that's not my problem. Again, it's very simple. This is QQQ. This is the NASDAQ ETF. NASDAQ market is selling off. You want to complain about it? It really doesn't matter because it won't change anything. NASDAQ market was rallying all of 2023. No one was complaining. It was extremely overbought. No one was complaining. We continue to talk about how overbought it was, yet no one prepared, right? The only people that freak out when the market pulls back are those that did not prepare, right? As of right now, Looking at this on the 30 minute time frame, check this out. Ever since we actually began to trade below this moving average, which is this little green line, it's super, super simple. Why overcomplicate your trading, right? If you want to be a bull, that's up to you. Again, all uh, best wishes to you. As of right now, every time that we go back to retest this moving average, rejection, 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 rejection. It doesn't matter every single time, even today, pre market. We continue and continue to get rejected. When looking at the five minute time frame, it's even getting that close, right? Rejection, 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 rejection. And now we're extremely oversold. Does oversold mean that it now has to recover? Heck no, it doesn't mean that it does. It means that it can, right? Just like anything can happen. But as of right now, we could continue to sell off. I mean, look how amazing 2023 has been. This is such a slight pullback in the grand scheme of things, which means that the Bears have so much more territory to cover based off of potential selling pressure. Now, you might be asking, why exactly is the market selling off? It's literally super simple. Well, the Federal Reserve announced their FOMC Fed minutes. This gave us a better understanding on why the Federal Reserve raised interest rates on the previous rate hike and also who voted for what and what their sentiment was for the up and coming FOMC rate hikes. And it sounds like they're very hawkish, which means that they have intentions. Majority of federal uh, Fed officials have uh, the intention to potentially continue to raise interest rates. If they continue to raise interest rates, this means that it will make it more expensive for people like you and I to borrow money, therefore spending less money, therefore contracting our economy. And that is why the market is selling off. There was nothing significant that was announced yesterday. There was nothing significant. I'm sorry. There's nothing significant that was announced today, nor was it announced, uh, for any economic report tomorrow. As of right now, it's literally super simple. We are getting rejected by the moving average on the 30 minute time frame. This is for NASDAQ, right? Lower highs and lower lows. And yes, it's nice when it maybe does rip up, but guess what? If we continue to get rejected on this moving average, then it means absolutely nothing. And it's simply a higher low for bears, for people that are in SQQQ, to be able to buy and continue to make more money. I mean, some of our LPP traders today made and had some of their biggest days, and that's because they focus on one thing, and that is market direction. No one should ever be telling you where to buy or where to sell. If you can't determine that yourself, then you simply are not ready nor disciplined enough to actually trade. Stop overcomplicating your trading and focus on one specific thing, and that's price action and direction. Allow the current to be with you instead of trying to fight it and going against you. Keep Keep your trading simple. And again, this is something that I test and challenge every single morning during my live trading session with the LPP team. I work with them and only them. And if you want to be able to watch me trade live as soon as tomorrow, remember, it's the second link in the description down below. It's a one-time payment, lifetime access. And right now it's $175 off. You don't have to join, <clears throat> but if you're tired of missing out and you're really struggling with this market, we love to keep it simple, right? And we don't overcomplicate it. There's no crazy bells and whistles or call outs or anything like that. It's just working with our team and focusing on one thing, and that's market direction and waiting for that proper confirmation instead of over, you know, overcomplicating it. So I really do appreciate you guys' time. I hope that we're in a thumbs up. I'll see you tomorrow for our live trading session. Again, the second link in the description down below. And for those that are into office art, check this out. We just dropped one of our new pieces. It's called the Emergency Cash shadow box and again it's now available at shoptechbuds.com which is the fourth link in the description down below if you want to pick it up like always let's make sure that we end the year on a green note take it easy team